This week in science, we're back at the Anthropology Museum talking about the first Europeans to ever visit North America. And no, it was not Christopher Columbus or his crew. There are many ways in which the story of Columbus discovering America just isn't true. One, you arguably can't discover a place where people already live. Two, he never actually set foot in North America. And three, we now have solid evidence that European Vikings were on the continent some 430 years before Columbus was even born. It comes from the Lons Omado site on the western coast of what is now Newfoundland. We already know the Norse settled there since you can still see the remains of eight timber framed structures, but exactly when they were hanging around has been something of a mystery until now. Researchers from the Netherlands studied several pieces of wood recovered from the site that they knew were felled by the Norse because the cuts were made with metal tools, which the area's indigenous residents didn't use. They were specifically looking for tree rings containing high levels of carbon-14, or radiocarbon. It's an isotope produced when high-energy particles from space rain down on the Earth. And we know this planet was absolutely blasted with such particles during a massive solar storm around 993 AD. So having found such a radiocarbon spike in three of the artifacts, it was just a matter of counting the growth rings between there and the outer edge. After all, one ring is one year. That gave them a firm date for when the Vikings were at Lonesome Odo, 1021 AD. If you want to dig into these findings, they are free to access in the journal Nature as of this week. To summarize, we can now say for certain that Vikings were hanging out on North America at least a thousand years ago, thanks to tree rings and a dash of astrophysics. With This Week in Science, I'm Curtis Doring, City News.